Good evening and once again welcome to my YouTube channel Maths with Ease by Mr. Gamotho and as we conclude set 2 there is a question in exam practice set 2 question number 6 that is the question we are going to conclude this topic with and it's telling us in a group of 100 students 40 play tennis let us have that information here um, the total number of students is 100 there are those who play tennis 40 play tennis 55 play football uh, or rather we have um, okay let's have 55 playing football football and uh, 30 play squash. There is squash. 30 are the ones who are playing squash. 8 do, do none of this. And then there is none. We have 8 people who are just lazy. They are not doing anything. Um, 12 students play tennis and football. Then there is tennis plus Football, we have 12. Uh, 18 play football and squash. Football plus squash, we have 18. Uh, and 10 play squash and tennis. Squash plus tennis, we have 10 students doing that kind of games. <coughs> Use Venn diagrams. To find out how many students uh, A play all three, three spots and B play only squash. First of all, <clears throat> we have to have the universe of Venn diagram. We must be having it here. This is universal. And within the universal, we must be having tennis. There are those who are doing tennis. There are those who are doing football. And there are those who are doing squash. And <clears throat> let us talk about information, the information that we have. We are told, we don't have the information of the people who are doing all three. So we have to have the intersection of the three games represented by an unknown x and then we talk about now we start moving outside the venn diagram the people who play squash and um, tennis they are 10 squash and tennis they are 10 within this intersec intersection we have 10 people we already have x so this region must be having 10 minus x. And remember, we are told that 8 do nothing. So they are just out there. 8 do nothing. They are outside. Um, the squash and tennis is done. Football plus squash is 18. Football plus squash is 18. And we already have x within that intersection. So in this particular part, we have 18 minus x. We are done with that. Tennis plus football is 12. Tennis plus football is 12. Within this intersection, that's where we are having 12. And we already have x there. So inside here, we are having 12 minus x. There we are. We have taken care of that. It goes without saying that um, the people who are playing squash are 30. The people who are playing squash are 30. And if we talk about 30 in total, we already have 10 minus x playing the squash plus this x plus 18 minus x. That in total is giving us 10 plus 18 is 28, minus x plus x, they cancel out, 
So we are left with 28 minus x. But we are told that 30 plays quash. So how many people are outside here? It is now the entire 30. It is now the entire 30 minus 28 uh, minus x, which is basically 30 minus 28 minus negative x means plus x, and we have 2 plus x. So we have, here we have 2 plus x. That is as far as the squash is concerned. We are done with that. 55 play football. 55 play football. And let us just see. Within football, we have 12 minus x. This is squash. Within football, we have um, 12 minus x plus this x plus 18 minus x. Uh, what is that? This is 12 plus 18 is 30 minus x plus x, that is 0. So 30 minus x is what we already have. But we are told that entirely there are 55 footballers. So outside in this region, we have to have 55 minus what we already have, which is minus 30 minus x, which is 50, 55 minus 30 minus negative x means plus x. And this is going to give us 55 minus 30 is 25, of, of course, plus x. So in this region, we have 25 plus x. We are done with football. What about tennis? 40 play tennis. This 40 playing tennis, we have to explain something to do with tennis now. Within tennis, we already have this 12 minus x. 12 minus x plus the x plus 10 ma minus x, which is giving us 12 plus 10 is 22 minus x plus x, that is 0, 22 minus x. And we are told that 40 play tennis. So we are going to have 40 minus bracket 22 minus x, which is going to be 40 minus 22 plus x, which is 18 plus x. That is what we have here, 18 plus x. And that is now, we have at least used each and every detail that we have. We can now go and answer our question. So the question is asking us, use a Venn diagram to find out how many students play all the three spots. In other words, we have to know what is the value of x because the value of x represents the intersection. And we have to have all of them adding up to 100 students. So what do we do? We take this part, <coughs> which is uh, 18 minus x plus this plus 12 minus x plus x everything now plus x plus 10 minus x plus 2 plus x plus 18 minus x plus 25 plus x plus 8 this is equals to 100 let us take all the whole numbers and we see what we have. 18 plus 12. Let us have 18 plus 12 uh, plus 10 plus uh, 2 plus another 18 plus um, 25 plus 8 equals to 93. We have 93. We have 93. Uh, what about x is now? Minus x. <clears throat> Minus x plus x. They cancel out. Minus x plus x. They cancel out. And then we have minus x plus x. 
they cancel out. And then we are left with only minus x, just one negative x. So um, uh, we, have, um, we have a plus x left. So negative x, because this is 18 plus x, by the way, so plus minus, plus minus, plus minus. So we are left with only one plus x because we have added all the constants. So 93 plus x is equals to 100. Meaning that if you want to get the value of x, we have to subtract 93 from both sides. And we clearly can see that x is equals to 100 minus 93, which is easily 7. So the answer to part A of the question, how many students play all the three games? The answer is 7 students play all the three games. Part B of the question, part B of the question is asking us, uh, is asking us how many play only squash? That is the question. How many, how many play only, only squash? Now, those who play only squash are actually two plus X because they have to play squash without any other combination, only squash. It is actually people or the students in this particular region, which is 2 plus the value of x, which is 7, and we have 9 students playing squash only. And that is the end of the question. Please subscribe, share, and comment, of course, and let us move on. Thank you.